Hello, this is Brian again. So I'm making my way up this dirt road to uh, do a backdoor approach of Iron Mountain. Snow's getting deeper over here, so I'm starting to starting to slow me down a bit. So it's like five, five inches deep over here. We're on the north face. And this snow right here has not been really broken in by anybody. But we're getting deeper over here. We're climbing. I don't know how much deeper this snow is going to get. I wonder if the snow on Santiago Peak is like this. Santiago Peak's almost 5,700 feet. But the, the harder, more deliberate steps I'm making is slowing me down a little bit. So I'm resorting to taking my time. Under normal soil conditions, this would probably be very easy stretch but the snow here will definitely slow you down a bit I think there would be this much snow this low down to be honest I mean I have boots in the car but I don't know if they would have been good for climbing up the fire break to get up here So now I'm getting a little bit of ice in my shoes. Not too bad. I think mean, snow will give you a, give you a pretty good workout. Not to mention it makes the scenery even more interesting than it otherwise would be. I mean, it's really interesting as it is, but. So we got some Tucker scrub oak up here too. Quirk is John Tuckery. A lot of holly cherry around here too. Even some flannel bush. So Chaparral here is even more recovered than it is further down by Monte Cristo campground. Beautiful hike. It's beautiful out here in the back country over here. Not quite as uh, touristy out here. Perfect for social distancing. Like a dummy, I forgot my mask in the car. But so far, I haven't been within 100 feet of anybody. Certainly not out here. Not out here at all. We're making this back door approach here. I'm trying to think if I should go all the way to the junction, all the way around, or Maybe cut through to the next fire break. Because there's one that's going to lead up this way towards the summit of the mountain. Still wonder. I don't know if that it really is round top over there. Can that be? It doesn't look extremely high. Much higher. It doesn't look like it's from where I am. I'm not even at 5,000 feet yet. For where I am, it looks like it's... That might not be it. Uh, that might not be round top over there. I don't know what that is. I'm pretty sure that's rabbit over there. Because rabbit eventually connects up with Granite Mountain. 
No, I don't think that's I don't think that's round top. Round top might might be one of these, actually. I think to get to round top would require a lot longer hiking. So I kept thinking that, that was it. There's no way that I can conceive of that peak there being above 6,000 feet. Back there, yes. But I cannot conceive of that being at 6,000 feet. Maybe six or 700 feet higher than where we are now. So definitely into the 5,000s. But round top is at 6316 in elevation. So here I am making my way slowly because it's hard to walk fast despite the level ground over here. Well, We'll see where I'm at, whether I decide to cut over the hill or follow all the way to the fire break. Way around there. So I'll update you and we'll see.